there. So I'm here with Miss Universe Singapore, Zara. Hi. How's your stay here? It's been really great. Thank you so much. You're welcome. So to know each other better, we will play a game. Are you ready? Yes, I am. Are you ready, Jay? Yes, I am. <laughs> okay. So let's start. Name three things you and me appear to have in common. I think you're really friendly and you're very approachable. The moment I entered, it was so easy to talk to you. And you have very big plans for the future and I think that's what we have in common. If a crystal ball could tell you the truth about yourself, your life, the future or anything else, what would you want to know? What would I turn out in five years' time? Yeah, that's exciting, right? Yeah, it's so very long. exciting. Five years is a really long time. Whom would you want as a dinner guest? I would really like to have dinner with Priyanka Chopra oh. because I think she is so amazing. She uh -huh. is such a big star, but she is she's worked really hard to get to where she is. Oh wow! Okay, do you have a boyfriend? Describe your ideal man or your boyfriend physically, and I am going to draw it. <laughs> okay, <laughs> prominent jawline, torn muscles, <laughs> mesmerizing eyes. Probably with messy hair. Messy hair? Are you good at drawing? I am terrible at drawing. And he has to be tall. Okay. Can I peek? Okay, so your ideal man is going to look something like this. You try your best. I tried my best. I'm so sorry. It's been a week since you've been crowned as Miss Universe Singapore. What yeah. has changed and how do you feel? I feel like I can really use Miss Universe Singapore as a platform to start doing everything I've always wanted to do and really go bigger with it. What is your most terrible memory? One time, I was walking down the runway and I fell in front of our chief minister in Penang. Oh my goodness. It was so embarrassing. Yeah. Before making a telephone call, yes. do you ever rehearse what you're going to say? Why? <laughs> do you? <laughs> I do. I actually do that. <laughs> I do. Um, so like when I pick up that call, I sound you know, assured and confident about what I'm going to say to that person and it's to the point. Because I, I love storytelling and sometimes I can get you know away with that. Like you go on and on. So straight away. Yeah, so straight away. Like to the main. Yes. If you could pick your roommate at Miss Universe International, who would it be? Right now it would be you. <laughs> because I know okay. you now and yeah. you're like the first contestant I've met. Thank you. This is like my last question for you. Okay. Oh, it's actually the same. Do you oh. have a boyfriend? Uh, Describe your ideal man or your boyfriend and I will draw it. Huh? My ideal boyfriend has to be taller than me at least. Someone who has sharp features. Mm -hmm. So sharp nose, sharp jawline. I expect too much. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, nice thick hair. Okay, so this is the best I've come up with. <laughs> Good job. Thick Thank you hair try. and um, nice jawline. Yeah, and really I hope nice. this is tall for you. Yeah, it looks good. <laughs> it looks good. Alright, there you have it. Miss Universe Singapore. I hope you enjoy the rest of your stay in Kuala Lumpur. Thank you so much. I will. I'm so happy to be here. And hope to see you soon at Miss Universe. Yes. Don't I'm forget excited. to follow us on Instagram, janetio underscore. And za16. And don't forget to follow us at Miss Universe Singapore as well. Alright, bye! bye.